the beast plank position and its variations. Every variation of the beast plank is meant to challenge the position of the beast plank just a little bit more. So the original position right here, you got wrists stacked right under the shoulders and we got our knees about two to three inches behind the hips. So if the hip goes straight down here, your knees back a little bit here. Wrists under the shoulders, knees a little bit behind the hips. We don't want to arch our back like this. We want a neutral pelvis, which means your belt buckle, where the top of your pubic bone is, shifts up to your belly button, so that low back is straight, not concaved. Then, knees two inches off the ground. And here is your beast plank. Every variation thereafter, we got shoulder taps, we got bird dogs, it's meant to challenge this core control. It's the core holding up this part of the body, okay? So these shoulder taps, we are meant to have stable, stable hips throughout the 